Just day in day out, we've talked about Wirecard. We've you know had a look at the exposure of some of the banks to Wirecard. What was Barclays' exposure in this? So um, uh, we have a a participation in the holding company's revolving credit facility. Um, 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 you know, clearly, a very manageable number for us. Um, but we also have, uh, you know, we do business with uh, uh, with Wirecard accounts in the UK. There are a lot of fintech companies that rely on those accounts, a lot of consumers that rely on those accounts. And I think there's a real concerted effort between, between Wirecard, between the government and between uh, the bank to manage this in a in the most beneficial way for ultimately the end uh, consumer. But, you know, this is going to pose a real challenge to... I think to uh, some parts of the financial technology industry, um, uh, you know, the banks are highly regulated and they're safe. Um, uh, and I think there's some things like e-wallets, which will probably get new attention. Um, uh, what we're seeing as a bank is we're seeing our deposit base grow because as people get worried, uh, they go back to the safe yeah. hands of the bank. This is really interesting, Jess. Thank you for answering this on Wirecard. And it's a movable feast, not only for, uh, for Europe and, and Germany, but also for America. I mean, Ernst & Young is really under the gun here. There's clearly a massive missed audit at Wirecard as well. I want you to speak for the rigor of auditing at Barclays. Do you feel there's any mysteries on your book in relation to Wirecard? <laughs> Do you think the auditing's tight enough just on simple things like what's an X number of banks? Yeah, no, we started taking a cautious approach to our card quite some time ago. Um, uh, you know, so again, uh, very mindful of well, all wait, of our wait, 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 wait. Jess, Jess, some time ago, like last Thursday or a few years <laughs> ago. <laughs> I'd say uh, uh, a long time ago, not, not last Thursday. You no, know, Wirecard did have you know okay. questions uh, 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 before, so we've been you know conservative in how we dealt with them. They are a very big business. They've got a very big business in the UK as well. It's a very tough uh, situation. Obviously, uh, it seems like something quite significant <clears throat> was missed, uh, and I think uh, and I think the markets will pay a price for it.